10,000 subscribers, thank you all, let's just get straight into it, no wasting time, go! You say 99% of YouTube content is terrible, so what channels or videos do you like? Well, at the moment, there's only one answer for me, and that's Red Letter Media. They're the only channel I will actively go out of my way to go and see, or watch, or listen to, or whatever. Is it difficult to hate against things that you actually enjoy in your videos? To be honest, no. Um, because I, I think ev anything I can think of, any subject, I can think of at least a few negatives that you can focus in on and expand. The thing is, like, when it comes down to liking something, it's usually down to, well, at least for me, there are more things I like about it than I don't like, which can be any number of things in each side, but that's ultimately what it comes down to, and I, on, on this channel I just focus on the negative things because it's usually more entertaining. What is the most genuinely threatening comment you have received, whether it was DeviantArt, YouTube, or whatever you do? For example, I'll find and kill you. Well, the, the one that comes straight to mind is one from DeviantArt, someone who was really pissed at me, um, for just silly, silly reasons, who said something along the lines of, I'm going to kill you and throw you, no, dr something like, I'm going to drown you, I'm going to throw you in a river and drown you? Something like that? I mean, it was it was funny, but, I mean, really, what, what was going on in his mind to uh, want to write that in the first place? Very strange. Which fandom do you associate yourself with the most? Now, I was thinking about this the other day, and I was like, wait, I, I don't think I associate myself with any fandom. I think I actively try and avoid it. I, I'm thinking of all the things I like, like, I don't know, Lord of the Rings, Halo games, and I just kind of avoid those fandoms completely, because I don't... They, they always seem just kind of awful to me. I mean, I, I can't imagine branding myself in a fandom. I mean, I know some people are into that sort of thing, but for me, I just like enjoying my own things in my own space, and I don't need to associate with... It's always cool to talk with other people that enjoy the stuff you do, but I don't know, there's like a level of how much of a fan you are, and when it goes to fandom, I think it can go a little bit too far, a bit too obsessive, but I guess that's just me. It's just why I think... Boo. So I got a couple of questions basically asking, like... Are you self-taught and how you draw, or why did you start drawing, that sort of thing? And basically, I mean, I don't really have an answer, I just sort of started when I was... I've always just sort of been doodling and drawing, and just sort of, you just improve the more you do it. It's like, if you want to get better at writing, you write. If you want to get better at drawing, you just draw. You just got to do it over and over. If you want to get better at editing, you just got to edit. You got to just take take the thing you're interested in and you just got to do it over and over even if you're crap at the beginning i mean you just got to keep going and doing it over and over and don't care what anyone else thinks so i chose this question not because i thought the question was like interesting or anything cuz i I've, I've never played the ratchet and clank series so i i don't know but what he says later is i'm sorry for what i said in the i hate sonic the hedgehog video please forgive me and i think that's really cool because when someone can sort of look past the i don't know the anger that they got cuz i mean i got some really weird and angry comments on that Sonic video, and it's cool to see someone who's actually, like, taken that and just gone, hey, wait a minute, that's, you know, it's just kind of silly to get so mad about something so stupid. So yeah, good on you, Supersonic Plush. Why do you not upload regularly do you hate YouTube? I thought uploading every uh, Friday is pretty regular to me, I mean, and if I, do I hate YouTube? I mean, YouTube's pretty good, um, place to upload videos and things, and it's got some good people on there. But, I mean, there there are certainly a lot of problems with it. Now this, this is something I've noticed. <laughs> Some, a couple, I don't know if it's the same person or a couple of people, they've actually gone and made an I love everything and an I'm neutral on everything account, which is a couple of characters I made from a really old video. I can't even remember which one it's from now, but it was a long time ago now. And they've actually made these YouTube accounts and they're commenting on things and they just asked, is your belly an innie or an outie? I think they spelled both wrong. No, they spelled innie wrong at least. Um, let me just check. Um, I'm an innie. I um, don't know why I didn't know that off the top of my head. And I'm neutral on everything, just put, I'm neutral on your question. It's just, it's just kind of funny, kind of cool that someone actually did that, I guess. I probably should have made those first and put something on them, but whatever. They can have them. Who do you think is worse, the people that refuse to listen to your opinion, or the people who, th who think you refuse to listen to their opinion? That's a good question. Like, personally, I, I don't really care if people won't listen to my opinion. It's when they're like dicks about it. I mean, I can appreciate other people, what they think, what they know, if they want, if that's their prerogative, they can do that, whatever, as long as they're not being dicks about it. But so many people, they're just like, wait, you think that? That means you're an asshole, and I hate you, and you're wrong, because you're different to me. I haven't really come across that many people who, I'm not sure, who think I refuse to listen to their opinions. I mean, I'm pretty open to what other people say. I mean, I, I even ask people, like, why do you think this? Why do you 
follow this thing. I mean, I, I read and maybe I don't reply to all of them, but I at least read like all these um, opinions and things that people say. I want to I want to know what people think, like why they're a brony or a furry or whatever. It's just interesting to me. So I don't know. I don't really know about the second part. I mean, I'd have to have someone challenge me directly to really instantly react to that. All right, everybody. I would like to welcome you to a new part of the show I'm doing called. James Corner. Uh, I can't really say. I don't know why I'm doing that voice. Welcome to James Corner, everybody. James Corner. Alex, if Flash murdered hundreds of people during the night, what would be your course of action? Now, if you don't know, Ambushed Orange is James. He's someone I know in real life, and he's a person. Um, he's he asks the worst questions ever. I mean, he's been in every single Q and A. I think I don't know if he was in the first one, but I mean, this question is terrible, James. Like, I'm not even going to answer that. Floss is my dog, by the way. It's, it's just like, why the hell did you even ask that? Why am I even featuring this? So anyway, I'm going to move on because I've got a couple of other people who asked things about James, which is kind of funny. What is your opinion on James? It's a good question because he's, a, he's an interesting person. He's not like any other person I think I've ever met. He's, he, he always says when you, when you like call him a name or something jokingly, you know, and he goes, no, I'm not that. I'm James. He always just says, no, I'm James. Like, after you say anything to him, he's like, no, I'm not that. My name's James. It's, it's weird. It's like he's like a cartoon character in real life. It's kind of amazing, actually. Aren't you friends with James? Yeah, I've known him for... I don't even know how many years now. It ages. Is your name actually Alex? Yeah, it is. I admit, my name's Alex. Now, but more interestingly, how did you meet James that much orange? I met him at, in school, and it was weird. I mean... And that's that, everybody. James Corner. Woo! Now let's go to something you might actually care about. The super. And the duper. The mega ultra. Of, um, what's it called again? I've done one of these in ages. The, su the lightning round. What is the most overrated meme ever? All of them. What would you do if aliens abducted you? I'd be happy because I'd have confirmation that aliens existed. Did you tilt your head to read this comment? No, I actually read it upside down. Genuinely, I did read it upside down. What is your real name, IHG? I, I already said earlier, but it's Alex. Why does Aquaman have Carl Dro Drogo's head? I don't know if that's right, but the actor who plays uh, Carl, Carl, I can't say his fucking name, in Game of Thrones, I think he's been cast to play Aquaman in the in the Batman Superman movie. Uh, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's either rumored or confirmed or something, but I think that's it, and I, I probably should have been more clear. Besides English, do you speak any other languages? If so, what language? Yes, you already know this. I, I'm fluent in Japanese. That is... It's not sarcasm. What's your favorite video you've done so far? It's got to either be the Druids video or the Sonic I Hate video because just people get so annoyed at the Sonic one. And it's so, so purposefully dumb. What's your thoughts on video game movies? Just terrible, awful, don't need to happen. Were you excited when you got 10,000 plus, I think it means subscribers, but yes. Do you plan on doing an episode about Tumblr? My answer not rhymes with, um, Ness? Yes? Reminds, it rhymes with that. Uh, yes. Would you rather eat Kite Man or Aquaman? I guess Aquaman, because he'd probably be more, like, fishy. Would you get involved in any YouTube drama around channels like blah 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 blah? Um, I don't think so. I don't really like drama like that, but I do want to do YouTube, like, collaborations with other people. If you have any suggestions of people who, who you should you want to see me do a video with, tell them and tell me. Um, probably should have put this in the part that isn't the lightning round. Lightning round! Are you British, or are you just really good at doing the accent? You got me, man. I'm not- I'm not British. I'm full-on American, bro. Uh, hot dogs and burritos. Um, no, I'm joking. I'm, I'm not American. Why are you so shit, lol? Fuck you, Ruben, you mass fake fanboy. Cam, will you do more I hate videos about famous YouTubers? I don't. I can't think of any I've actually done about specific YouTubers. I mean, the PewDiePie one wasn't about him. So, no, I guess. For your new series, The Search for the Worst, how would you cope with the IMDb with... Uh, it's got a constantly updating list. What am I doing? Um... Would the, would the series continue forever? No, um, I'm actually going to address this in the next episode, which should be coming soon. God, that movie was fucking terrible. I mean, I watched it last night. My God, it was awful. We have never seen your face, so are you a boy or a girl, or both? I'm a... I'm obviously a, a girl. Wee, look at me. Wee. Not really sure why I did that. That's obviously every girl in the world right there. You ever played Dark Souls? If so, do you think it's as hard as everyone says... Everyone says no, I hate Dark Souls. The worst thing ever. Which video is yours get some nice bullshit from dumbass and plebs? Um, probably the furries video. Probably the furries video. How tall are you? I don't, let me just check. Okay, I'm like six foot, maybe just under. Have you ever seen such a weird video about? Yes. Which video of yours got the best feedback? Probably the, the origin of I, of me.
So that's it, folks. Um, lovely little Q and A there. Um, so many questions. Sorry if I didn't get to yours. I mean, it, it really was in about the six or seven hundred questions mark. I did go through all of them. Um, some of them were pretty good and didn't make it. Some of them were quite weird, so I didn't feature them. Or maybe I did feature them if they were weird. Um, so yeah, thanks um, again for so many people being interested in my weird videos. I really do appreciate it. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. And before I just keep droning on about how thank you, um, that doesn't even make sense. Have a look at some cool fan art someone did. I'm going to start putting these at the end of videos because I've got some I can put here now. Look at this. I, I'm not sure which one I've chosen, but look at this. It's cool, isn't it? Look how cool that is. Anyway, so thanks for watching. All comments and ratings are appreciated. I'll see you next time. Bye.